Hi guys, welcome to the unboxing and full review of this b 5 5th generation high performance office mini PC of course also works for gaming because it has a very capable CPU and GPU built in. It comes with a full Windows 11 Pro 16 GB of RAM and 500 GB of SSD and it supports Wi-Fi 6E and dual screen display in high resolution and so we have quite machine here it's even faster than some i7 intel cpu and it's a really nice packaging and like always it's available in different configurations and as far as i know this is the top of the line by the way also supports worldwide power supply awesome a really nice box which could be also a nice gift like for christmas or so comes with a user manual but i mean it's windows 11 and uh, it's pretty much standard comes also with a hard disk installation guide yeah we can open and add or replace the memory and add some hard disks here on the left side we have the accessories we have the power supply and some mounting material like for your tv and two full-size hdmi cables and so here we have the pc itself really nice beautiful you can see all the openings ports we have the gigabit ethernet then we have two times usb two times full-size hdmi we have this heat exhaust here also on the side and here two times usb 3.0 we have usb c we have the headphone and microphone check and we have the on off and we have even the bios reset here comes also with this solid soft rubber feet and if you want to add or replace or exchange the hard disk or memory we can do that easily by removing these four screws here and then we just pull up the lid just be careful because it's already connected with this hard disk drive here so you can see we have the memory here we have the ssd here and an easy slot to expand with a hard disk drive also really important to know that we can enter the bio setup with delete and go to the boot options menu with f7 pressing during the boot up so I'm going to start this PC and then set up Windows 11 and then I'm going to show you some performance tests, uh, Office, Browser, Gaming and some other stuff. And so let's turn it on here and see what happens. So we see the B-Link sign here and it goes automatically into the Windows 11 setup and so we can choose the language and all other stuff. And it's always recommended to not connect to the internet right now. Do it only after you see the Windows 11 desktop. So remove the check mark here and say I don't have internet. And continue is limited setup. So I haven't been using the stopwatch but I would say it was something between 5 and 10 minutes. So really fast. We are here already on the desktop and now we can connect to the internet. And now it's time to do the updates Windows 11 update security patch and everything and this can take a while has nothing to do with this pc it always takes a long time it could be many hours even for fast pcs but you can work during this time you can download and install your software you can use like office software or so but don't do any performance tests don't do any gaming because you will be disappointed as long as you don't have done all the windows updates so the windows up to date so we can start using it fully but of course we also want to check some information here so we can see the system information cpu and the windows 11 pro and 16 gigabytes of ram and here the storage information of course after formatting we have only 463 gigabytes that's pretty much normal and we can see there's still plenty left even after installing all the office games everything there's so much space left here and so let's do a little bit of performance test here on google chrome you can see that we have many open tabs here and we can scroll really fast up and down it's absolutely incredible you can see full desktop 
performance, I would even call it high desktop performance on all these pages here. Absolutely no problems to see. And so of course we can also go to Google Maps 3D and the performance is absolutely phenomenal. There are zero lags, really nothing to see. Whatever I do, it will exactly respond here. And this is something where a lot of mini PCs are struggling, but not here. And what's absolutely phenomenal, I mean, we are running this PC on the highest possible speed. And when we point the camera here to the side, there's almost nothing to hear regarding the fan. Usually when we are doing this performance test, then we can hear very loud spinning fan and almost overheating these things. And this mini PC has absolutely no problem. I would say this mini PC has the best thermal efficiency which I've ever seen. And it's not like that, it's not cooling here. When I hold my hand here in the back, I can feel that a lot of hot air is coming out. But apart from that, there is almost nothing to feel. And especially, it's not getting loud. The AC in the back is much louder than this mini PC. And so here I'm on Rocket League, you can see 1080p with high quality resolution. Yeah, I'm not the greatest player on earth, but you can see we get a solid 44, 46 frames per second. Yeah, absolutely amazing. That's something which I've never seen before in this detail with 1080p. Yeah, okay, I failed, but the graphic, the quality of gaming on this machine is absolutely awesome and it's not even getting loud or hot or so. This is the most impressive thing here. And so also no surprise that we also in Asphalt 9 we can see huge game experience, absolutely no lags, a lot of fun. You can see that here, I can do everything what I want. And of course, open office, we shouldn't even have to talk about this thing. This is so super fast. Absolutely no question about that. And so here as a last test, full 4K resolution, YouTube video, nice, smooth, doesn't get any better than that. And there's still almost nothing to hear when I stop this thing here. The only thing which you can hear is the AC running in the background, nothing to hear from this mini PC. So this absolutely fantastic so i can highly recommend it and so i'll put down the link where you can buy it into the description of the video so you can check it out and order it right from there if you like it and i hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below and i'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel thanks for watching see you next time